Hi everyone, Shane Hennessy here. It's the 1st of April 2021 and here's what's new on the Fretboard Atlas. In the All Things Guitar section, we've been looking at a new guitar groove in D major, which is very typical of my style. And we've also been looking at cross picking for the first time, also known as string skipping. This coming month we'll be looking at banjo rolls in the style of Jerry Reed, and we'll also be talking about position changing, which is a skill that is crucially underestimated for fluid playing. In the under the hood section we've been looking at two different exercises to make your fretting hand thumb work harder, in other words how to make it stretch, and we talk some more about improvising. I've broken down my 12 bar blues improv into sections where I explain each note and where each musical choice comes from, as well as some insight into how to analyse the notes. This coming month we'll be looking at the home recording process and also some steps you can take when you aren't feeling inspired, creative or motivated. We'll also be talking about covering a lot of territory on the fretboard itself by using movable chord shapes something that's really practically useful for your guitar playing. In the traditional Irish music section we've been learning about slip jigs for the first time and through those videos we learn about playing in 9-8 time and we learn the popular tune The Butterfly. This coming month we're going to look at hornpipes in detail and I'm also going to talk a lot about choosing accompanying chords for traditional Irish tunes because that's a subscriber request. It seems to be very popular on the channel so I'm excited to get into talking about that. In the Shane's original section we've been looking at my tune Model from my first album Zephyrus. That's a really popular tune among my students because of its accessibility and its technical usefulness. This coming month we're going to be looking at my tune Reed and Green which is a great tune to learn some non-conventional sort of jazz chords and also my tune Montmartre which uses a special thumb technique to imitate a lo-fi hip-hop sound. In the interviews and extras section we've heard this month from Richard Smith about his approach to arranging improvisation and most importantly how he practices to be such a clean and versatile player and we've also spoken with David Howley of Wee Banjo 3 about his take on Irish music and playing in Dadgad. This coming month we're going to be listening to Emil Ernebro from Sweden and Joe Robinson from Australia about their guitar playing styles and they have some really really fascinating stuff in their interviews so I highly recommend watching them. Remember as well that this channel is all about what you want to learn. So any suggestions or comments, anything that would make the channel better or more suited to you, whether it's something particular or something broad, an area of music we haven't covered yet or something super specific, leave a message and let me know because that's the material that I want to get to you. So if all of that sounds good to you, grab your guitar and let's start learning.